Every life in Daisy begins and ends the same way. The world is over, but there are still wonders to be seen. This is our survivor, Daisy. She travels the road alone. Her goal is to see the seven Daisy wonders of the world. Can she survive and travel to all seven? Thank you for joining me on this Daisy journey. Enjoy the episode. Enjoy. All right, what is good, everybody? So we made the cold, magical ice swim to this wonder of the world here in Daisy. We are on Prison Island, and this is Daisy, like the flower, that's her name. This is her touring the seven wonders of the apocalypse. Uh, Rax is in the party because he has built a base in that prison. Now we're on a public server, and uh, the base has been raided pretty badly, but he's restored it. And it's a pretty epic base. Rax, I'm seeing a lot of zombies out here. So I'm devising a plan. I don't know if it's a particularly good plan. But it's a plan. That was me. Do you remember that band Four Seasons? I don't. Uh, they actually them. have a play on uh, Broadway right now. It's a group of four musicians um, that used to sing. Uh, okay. It's an older band. <clears throat> okay. But uh, when you say it, I'm working my way over, like I, I thought of that band because that's like one of the lines in their song. Oh, really? Yep. Is that you running across the bridge? That's me on the bridge. My, You know, the reason why I was a little late, since you told me that... Um, Ooh, you were, that was a loud one. Yeah, I think the suppressor broke. Uh, move to the, out of my crossfire. Okay, there you go. And then we start our 2024 survival run. All right, well, we're not going to uh, go down. I guess I'll just What's leave up? it unlocked right now. The door. Okay. I'm out of bolts. I got a whole bunch of feathers if you want. Um, I might have some. I got to make some. Fire axe is nice. What's he got? Well, this guy's got some uh, ammo and a mag. Are you, are you not really collecting that stuff now that the wipe is coming? Are you going to just load up on different types of stuff, right? Uh, I'm going to load up a little bit of that everything. Dude, there's a, a SSG scoped in here just sitting on the ground. Prisoner pants. Yeah, this... Dude, basing this thing up, man, it drops some nice loot for you. Are the tents all gone? Let's see. Ooh, you still got some tents back here. Yep. Still got some tents. The downside is zombies do spawn in here, but you just clean them up real quick and go about your day. You know, when you log Funny in, enough, right? I noticed that um, when we had more stuff down, they stopped spawning in here. Oh, okay. And what happened to the flagpole? Lucky epically put up the flag. Is that gone? Oh, it's still up. Yeah, I put up a new flag. They took right. the old one down, and I put a new one in. We weren't that happy with the old flag itself anyway. Right? We were kind of like wanting a cooler looking one, or were you good with it? Yeah, I think this one's cooler, actually. Yeah, the one with like the Daisy logo. Is that that one? I'm looking at it from a funny angle. It looks like it might be. Which one is it? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, I think that's, it is that's the a Daisy cool one. one. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure what wonder would be next here, Rax. Where I would go next. There's a hard one. Okay. I'm not sure, but we should probably get you through the water what the first. Heck? And yep. then dry it off immediately. Yeah. Otherwise your stamina is going to be pretty low. Yep. So yeah, all kinds of goodies. There we go. Yep. Let's see the flag. This is probably the most epic base I've ever been in. It's just such a cool idea to wall off the entrance. I probably won't stay in here long. Is it locked up? Uh, I could unlock that door. There's only one. 
Yeah, well, we've checkmarked another one of the Daisy Wonders of the Apocalypse. Kind of want to see the flag, but it's too dark. That doesn't help. That's all right. All right, so we uh, hit the Wonder of the World, the prison. There it is, way back there. I edited it out. Um, Rax and I walking. And talking about the next season of the Lucky series. I'm going in the big I house. I got another can of cat food. <laughs> yeah. Hey, cat owners, put the cat names in the uh, in the comments. Oh, someone died in this room with their head torch. That would be kind of creepy, though, to be outside and see a head torch moving around in the in the house upstairs. I bet a lot of people yeah. get kind of paranoid. I'm gonna eat some food up here. You know, playing alone, if you play scared, you know, and you see all these lights moving about. Yeah, we should get that chicken before we go. We can find it. All right, this was your room in the apocalypse. And you had a generator and this PC still worked. And you could only have one game. What game would you have? Put it in the comments. Rax, what game would you have? One game. Well, to last the whole apocalypse. You see, that's very hard because you wouldn't have internet connection anymore. Oh, so you wouldn't be able to play server games like Daisy Let's pretend you can. Let's pretend there is internet. Well, let's do both. Let's say with internet, my game would be this. Without internet, my game would be that. So with internet, I think... if the internet's still up, somehow, <laughs> some way, and there's other survivors hiding in bunkers playing video games, and you can log on and play with them, what would you pick? Yes, not a cola. If it was an online game that I could play with other people? Correct. You know what? It's probably this and State of Decay 2. <laughs> this and State... You can only pick one. Did you say this or State of Decay well, 2? Well, this would be my online game. And yes. And my single-player game would probably be State of Decay 2. I'm kind of thinking the same thing, man. I'm kind of thinking the same thing. You and I haven't played that much State of Decay 2. What's the deal with that? Uh, I actually... Too busy playing DayZ is what it is. I have been. I've been playing mostly DayZ with you. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, if I couldn't do that, what game, I don't know what other game, uh, audience, put your internet game, and your non -on, your offline game, if you had two games for that PC up there. I remember a game like Age of Empires or whatever, you gotta like, balance the economy, upgrade your technology, I don't know if it was Age of Empires or something like that, way back. Civilization? Oh, broken. Civilization, maybe, something like that. And I got, in college, man, I got too into that game. Now, I didn't go overboard like hours and hours and hours a day, but I thought about it for hours and hours and hours a day. And when I got a chance to game it, it was awesome. Is that game not as good as I remember it? I remember it being like just a take over my life brain power game. Like I couldn't wait to sit down and do it. But I was pretty disciplined to get all my work done and everything first. Am I... For me, that was uh, World of Warcraft. Yes, and... For... Maybe, yeah, War Warcraft 2 took over my life for a little bit at the end of high school. One where it's like a top-down and you raise knights or goblins. Yeah. But yeah, it was yeah. before the World of Warcraft that took over. Okay, I hit the pig and he just got mad. He's probably got a bolt in his butt right now. I'm chasing him with the... Who ordered this mill to go? Oh, he's running towards a bunch of zombies now. This could get interesting. You have no suppressed weapons. And I found the chicken, so bonus. <laughs> it's it's uh, farm animals. Let's see if I can hit this guy before I have to kill these zombies. Alright, this is getting outrageous. Oh, they're chasing him for me. Tainted meat! I'm gonna kill oh, this zombie. That. Yeah. Oh, I got two zombies on me. They switched. One of them was attacking me. The other was attacking the pig. And then the one attacking the pig came to attack me. And the one attacking me went to attack the pig. How random is that? Oh, 
Oh no, don't go in the water. I go now. left, you go right. I just don't want him to go in the ocean. So we might lose him. I might just have to go loud and shoot him, I don't know. Are you gonna shoot him? Good shooting. Got him. Good shooting. Excellent. Oh, and I get my bolt back. It's sticking out of his butt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get it back before it just so I don't lose it. I don't think I would lose it. Oh, this might be ruined. Nope, I can take it. All right. All right. I'm going to pull out a gun and just keep an eye on things. Good call. I'll keep an eye on the food. And I will also pull out a gun. You know, I haven't really cut any of my guns down in this game. No, I haven't either. I always forget I can do that. Should be done any second now. Should be done, man. Nope. Come on. Oh, there we go. Okay. Sounds good. Or do you got to take your whole face mask off? Here's a coke for you. Oh, nice. Pork and a coke. That's living. Mind if I have another. Nice crackling fire. Nice hangout. Can I ask Coke more on the, the floor. Pocket, yeah, this is great, man. You got quite the gear. Yeah, bring a can of peaches with you. If you're going to go up that way, you might need something that doesn't spoil. I'm just going to go find a place to have a sleep after all this. Yeah, thanks for the peaches. I want to be eating uh, yep. dog food now, cat food. If you're enjoying the channel, click the join button and become a member. You'll get a lot of exclusive content, State of Decay 2 playthroughs, Daisy therapy sessions, a lot of extra content. Every penny goes towards Brooklyn's education. Also, take a moment, click the link below, check out the merch store. Cool gear, stickers, hoodies, shirts, and let's keep gaming straight through the apocalypse.